Hell yeah. Nice. All right. Eating Colonel's bucket. <laughs> <laughs> Extremely loud. I couldn't hear anything if you said anything. <laughs> that was good. Could I continue? Oh, it said I can continue. I press continue. Good fuck. All right, I recorded that as an intro. All right, I press record again. Restart my recording. How oh, now we're. Oh, it saved me at the classroom. It That's saved good. me uh, oh, yeah. at the beginning of the dog. It's a, well, it's a it's a dating sim, so yeah, there should be like some save you know, saves. To yeah, clean yourself up. Dang I'm just gonna like rush yeah, through this because you and I've already done this. Yeah, and I'm gonna try to get as far as I can really quickly. Um, chicken snack. That was it's not a very good sniper. Uh, sit by Colonel Sanders. Skip literally all the Ooh. monologue because I've already done this with you. Extremely looking at you, Pop. Uh, oh Pretty shit, I cool. fucked up. Well, we're Pretty leaving. We're off. leaving. How do I exit? Fuck, Spork. Spork, Spork. Blew that fucker up. Cartel metal? What? They give oh, out I have to. I have to start over. Fuck this. I'm starting over. Like, completely? Yeah. Fuck that. I, I got Did a question wrong on the test because I was clicking too fast. Can you save at least, or...? Oh, I'm about to find out. It's not letting me. Fuck. Let me oh, leave. God. Let oh, me fuck. leave. Get in the car, nerds. We're going shopping. Oh, okay. I'm back at the swim towards the light question. Culinary heart. Okay. Yes. It worked. I'm, I'm every, done. You approach yeah, Colonel Sanders. Colonel Sanders. Like okay, okay, we're back at the thing. Okay, okay. So now we're back where we were. Colonel Sanders smiles ever so softly as you approach. He stops what he is doing and allows you to break the silence. Colonel, I wonder if I could talk to you for a second. Anything for a fellow chef. What exactly is on that chicken? <laughs> How bold of you to come out and ask. It's an idea I had it's for a new combination of flavors that will make me my fortune and establish my legacy for all time as I open a chain of highly successful fried chicken restaurants. No big deal. It's just you and me here. I can keep a secret. In fact, I got some of my own that I'd be willing to trade. Colonel Sanders, what's the rush? Some mess is only getting started. We've got two, two more whole days to get oh, to fuck. know each other. He's clearly not giving oh, it up easily, but it doesn't hurt to be persistent. You know what they say about secrets, Colonel? Shouldn't learning be fun? Oh, Jesus, that's an innuendo and a half. You got some moxie, I'll give you that. Colonel Sanders looks both ways to make sure you're truly alone. Then he leads in. You can feel his warm breath as he whispers. Just one ingredient, I but you can't girl. tell. I use, oh my fucking God, it's blinked out. Oh, God. I use blank and it's literally blank. It's white screened right there at that little spot. Okay. It's something That's my great guess. grandmother taught. Weird me. guess. Weird guess. Oh, okay. Now I'm sure. At the end of the game, you're gonna find out the fucking secret. The quote unquote secret recipe. Love. It's gonna be love. Either that, or you could spread love. some kernel cheeks. Either one. <laughs> what? Spread some Kentucky Fried cheeks. Blank? Wow! Oh, fuck, you'd I never have guessed that. In fact, you're not even sure you'd get where you'd get some if you searched. I wonder if the stream is even up, because my phone is saying it's up. Uh, wait. Give me a second. Wait. Okay, I'm gonna look for it, too. Phone. While you're wrapped up in that huge revelation, you notice that Colonel Sanders has disappeared. <laughs> While everyone else is still in the cafeteria, you decide to look for him. You find Colonel Sanders outside, sitting in the quad. Oh, it's you again. Howdy. 
Sometimes I like to come inside and look at the school buildings and think about how my story will continue on after I've graduated. Sounds like you have big plans. I dare say the biggest. I will leave my mark on this world. You bet that. Okay. Neg him to you show you his strength. Wow him, but with a big idea to add an additional ingredient to really spice things up. Be modest but thoughtful. I'm going to be modest but thoughtful. Well, oh my god, the hearts went around him. Well, I just wanted to okay. tell you that I really enjoyed your food. It's streaming, it's working. <laughs> okay, yeah, I, I can see. Yeah, just leave I, like a I comment can, and it'll, it'll save it online. Yeah, you see it now, huh? <laughs> I yeah. told you I should have streamed it from the beginning. Oh, just rewind it. The stream should be up from the beginning. From the beginning? Yeah, it's up from the beginning when I launched the game. Okay. Wait, so like, you first launched the game? Yeah. It'll have oh, the shit. intro. Okay. Well, I just wanted okay. to tell you that I really enjoyed your food. Oh, that, no, that's supposed to be me talking. Oops. Uh, I have you gotten his attention. Geez. The flavors were complex, but comforting. <laughs> <laughs> You're seeing it, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, I can finally see now. <laughs> you can see why I was laughing so hard. The interplay between salty, savory, and peppery, it was perfect. I'm not going to lie. When I had KFC the other day, it was actually really good. Fuck. I appreciate the compliment. Ainsley Harriet. Oh jeez, he said your name. I'm sure that you'll be a big success. I know we've only met today, but I'm starting to get the same feeling about you. Oh Jesus Christ. We should head back oh, inside. No. The next lesson starts soon. You step inside a massive cooking area where the attention le afternoon lesson will take place. Each student gets an oven and all the tools and ingredients that, sh that, are that could be needed. Look at this place, it's magnificent. Finally, we get to show our stuff. Wait a second, oh no, we have to show our stuff. What if I totally blow it? You're not going to blow anything. Except maybe kisses to the crowd of fans. Well, I can name something she's about to blow. Um, except maybe kisses to the crowd of fans you're going to earn with your signature adorable tiny food creations. Welcome students to the cooking arena. For today's lesson, we will be cooking with partners. Hurry up and pair off. Naturally, Miriam looks over at you, but anyway, go control yourself. You pounce on Colonel Sanders. Hey, Colonel, would you like to tackle the, this lesson as a team? A team of two, that is, me and you, if that wasn't clear. Want to be my partner? Sure, Ainsley Harry, I'll prepare a station. Without you as a partner, Miriam is left standing all alone. Two different students quickly take notice. Hello, new partner, pop, clank, beep, boop, bzzzt. Oh, my, two potential partners. I'm sorry, gentlemen. I don't know who to choose. I guess we'll look behind Friend duties can be a little awkward, but that's pretty pay for not being alone forever. I can ask Popper oh, Clank. God. Clank. I fucking died. God damn. Pop. Okay, I finally see Pop. That's a fucking faggot. Yeah. <laughs> Hold it there, fella. We don't even know what the Simon is yet. I don't trust machines. Clank judders and panel shakes loose. You might get the impression that this is a sign of affection. Looks like you two will be fine. Now it's time to focus on your own cooking classwork. All right, for you two, for today's lesson, we're going to keep it simple. Pick a basic dish and divide up the steps. The chef is on an island, blah, blah, blah. Which dish would you suggest to your partner, Corona Sanders? Um, steak tartar seems easy enough. It's fancy. You don't even need to cook it. Using octopus will blow Colonel Sanders' minds. Your grandmother's mashed potato. I'm doing the mashed potatoes and gravy. Oh my god, I got a heart, tell ya. Yeah, did we ever fucking yeah, KFC? Every, do ever. anything KFC related, that's literally it. <laughs> anything KFC and related. And that will get you laid by Colonel Sanders. <laughs> I've always been something of a down-home chef. I was thinking we could make something warm and inviting, comforting. Maybe mashed potatoes? Colonel. And gravy? <laughs> I couldn't imagine one without the other. Colonel Sanders casts a coy look at you. Causing your whole face to get beat red, embarrassed, and quickly turn away. I'll go get the potatoes. No, please, let me. Pific picking perfect produce is a passion of mine. Oh, I'll pick something off of you, baby. What's up? <laughs> Ashley, looks like things are getting pretty fresh around here. Does someone have a crush on Colonel Sanders? We're just cooking partners. Mind your own business. Sanders' oh, heart is my business. Like you better Sanders. keep your fingers off my man. <laughs> Van Van, did someone call for me? Ugh, no, jeez, Van Van. While I'm over here crushing Ainsley Harriet's dreams, you're supposed to be taking care of our classwork. 
That's the deal, remember? Oh, okay, I like that face. Colonel Sanders like returns. That face. <laughs> yeah, she actually looks kinda cute. Arms full of peeled potatoes. He tosses them into a boiling. Are you watching it now? Like uh, live? Up yeah, dude. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I see. He tosses them into boiling water and turns his attention to you, and your, and your old friends. Oh, howdy there, Ashley Van Van. I'm working in a quartet Oof. instead of a duet now. Actually, no. It looked like Ainsley Harriet was struggling, so we offered to give him them a hand. You know how it is. These younger amateur chefs need a lot of mentoring. I was going to say, Colonel Sanders, maybe I should also teach you a thing or two about fans and food. Maybe one day you might be able to get caught up, get up to my level. Ha! Doubt it. Don't be rude, Van Van. Personally, I have no doubts whatsoever about Colonel Sanders' ability to concoct creations worthy of admiration. After all, your fried chicken was quite spectacular. But Colonel, if you ask me, I might make a better partner than this thing, than this that has positioned itself at your station. Don't you feel deep down that we cast complimentary shadows, we fit together like a thigh and a drumstick? It just makes sense. Nothing about this makes sense, but one thing is clear, she's coming for Colonel if you don't watch out. As she's really going at you hard, you need to ask for some backup here before things get ugly. Damn it. Turn to Colonel Sanders, hunk of hunks in your time of need, or turn to Miriam, your forever bestie who always has your back. Oh god. That's actually kind of hard. That's really hard choice. Can, can you save? Uh, I don't know what this button does up here, and I don't want to... I think the popcorn one does save, right? Probably. Alright, um, should I turn to Miriam or should I turn to Colonel? Damn, okay. Uh, maybe the childhood friend. I'm doing, I'm, I, I went Colonel. I'm here to learn to express myself via my cuisine, not bicker with prima donnas. Partners were chosen at the beginning of class, so let's all respect that format, okay? Turn to Colonel Sanders to confirm that you're on the same page. I chose Colonel Sanders and Colonel Chandler so is me, isn't that right? Businessman respects all fair agreements from contracts and handshakes. I took on Ainsley Hair. Oh, I forgot. I was supposed to be reading in his voice. A businessman respects all fair trade agreements from contracts to handshakes. I took on Ainsley Harriet as my partner for this activity, and I stand by it. Based on your teammate's behavior, I'd say you're perfect for each other. Neither of you and Ainsley Harriet's natural talent or their loyalty. Being defeated by Colonel Sanders leave you feeling proud and full of potential. Oh, being defended, oops. You look for Sprinkles in hopes that he might step in, but he's nowhere to be found. Darn those cute corgis and their short but sturdy stature. Look down at your station and realize that in the tension of a moment, your hands have been cooking on autopilot. Distracted by drama, you've already crushed the boiled potatoes into a perfectly creamy mashed texture. Plenty of butter and cream for flavor. It's, it's as if you're natural. Yeah, this is a massive ad. Uh, well, your attention elsewhere. I know, I know just what to do. Colonel Sanders sends his hands. He's holding a beautiful white porcelain gravy boat, oh, which pours a smooth brown gravy smother, smothering your neatly finished potato dish. <laughs> Face the chicks giving. <laughs> gravy flows down the mound of mashed potatoes. The result looks spectacular. Granny would be very proud. Colonel holds out a spork out to you. Can I, like, exit the game? Like, is there, like, a way to exit the game? I think, uh, try escape. Escape? I'm pressing uh, escape. I've been pressing escape. Oh, God, bro, you can't skip this ad. <laughs> <laughs> the unskippable ad. The rumors are true. That's how they I'll, get I'll, you. I'll, what, is, what is it? Alt F4? I'll fucking do it. Van Van mashed potatoes with gravy. Press the power Pathetic. Button. In just a few minutes, I've prepared a full meal. Gaze upon my specialty. Braised tentacle of octopus in a silky salt water sauce. Plated on a battle axe blade forged on my supreme chef ancestors. What You've the ignored fuck? me for too long. This ends now. It is I who will have the first bite, and you will all look on with envy. Rushes at Van Van and swipes a bite of his signature dish right off the plate. No, don't. Something about this dish doesn't strike my nose quite right. I think the octopus was rushed and might have turned in the process. The result could be toxic. Too late. It's been eaten. I uh think I left something in the oven. I don't feel so good. 
Mr. Oh no, he died. <laughs> he killed him. No, I should have been like, Mr. Rest Stark, peace, I don't Stalker. feel so good. <laughs> <laughs> it killed him. Everyone step back, don't take another bite. When you look back at the plate, the rest of it is gone. You notice the tip of the tentacle being slurped up in Pop's mouth. Pop winces in pain for just a moment, then it's almost immediately back to his oblivious self. Oopsie. Tastes like poison. Holy shit. He really, he really died. <laughs> yeah, he fucking dead, I, I just saw the ghost. What the fuck? Um, I'll, I might alt F4 this, because I'm going to alt F9. Alright, recording has been saved. Yeah. Alt F4. Okay. And it's done, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to leave it at that. Part 2. <laughs> Part 2. Oh, this more like fucking long ass KFC ad. Hell yeah, ladies and gentlemen. I'll see you all fucking later, I think. I don't know. <laughs>